Hi guys, just going to do a little demo of this awesome little buffer from Tate Effects. Uh, Tate Effects sent me this to do a demo and I really, really like it. The coolest feature about this thing is the fact that the LED changes colours. It feels like Christmas. It's just fantastic. So this is based on a Pete Cornish style um, input buffer and Pete Cornish pedals. And they've managed to house it in this very pedal friendly little enclosure. And it just restores all of this stuff that's lost by going into true bypass pedals or long cables. And it really, really does that. So I'm going to give you my clean sound. I'm running a custom shop no caster through Van Damme cable into a couple of true bypass pedals. From there it's going through a 15 foot cable into my 65 twin reverb reissue. So I'm going to play a little bit on all three pickup settings and then I'm going to do a very rudimentary changeover. Um, because I don't have a true bypass looper yet. And I'm going to let you hear what this thing does. So here's my clean signal. This is my no caster into my twin. <laughs> So just for reference, here's the neck pick up again. And I'm going to do a very, very basic changeover, so please don't laugh. I heard you laugh. So, here is the signal now going through the buffer. So as you can hear it has a huge amount of sparkle and that is what the amp and guitar sound like if I was to use a 5 foot cable between them. So it restores all that top end goodness. Before this I had a TC electronic buffer and not to knock TC stuff because they make some great products but it didn't seem to restore the really high frequency, um, high fidelity stuff that the 10k and above frequencies weren't there. So it added a little bit of bottom end and boosted the volume but it didn't bring back the detail that's missed when you go through so many true bypass pedals. And I can safely say this thing brings back all that detail and doesn't add anything that's not there before. So I can recommend for the price of them go out and buy one now.